it's your boy Fabian back again with another video and it's time for yet another Britain's Got Talent 2023 Golden Buzzer reaction and this time it's a group Golden Buzzer from all the judges and 10 decks included too and this time it goes to the dancer Musa Mata and to be honest with you I've seen his semi-final because obviously we're in the middle of the live performances now the semi-final live performances so I've seen that one but I didn't manage to see this one so I thought you know what um, I'm gonna check that one out because obviously I reacted to every golden buzzer and then if you guys want me to I'll react to the live semi-final one too but obviously that's gonna come from a different point of view because I have seen it but before we check out guys make sure you subscribe down below press the bell notification button down below so you can be the first to know when I upload make sure you check out all the other Britain's Got Talent 2023 reactions because I've done quite a few but let's stop the talking and crack on with the video the eighth golden buzzer in Britain's Got Talent 2023 it goes to Musa Mota let's go Do you know what's crazy? Yeah? The dance moves are so, so sharp. Obviously, like I said, I haven't seen this audition, but I have seen him in the live semi-finals and obviously he's made it to the final. He was incredible, brought a tear to my eye. His story, a very emotional story. Um, but yeah, what a talented guy. And it was very clear to see from the first literally 10 seconds in his, um, in his audition. Do you know what, yeah? I'll be honest with you, um, like, a lot of these um, movements, even if you've got two legs, yeah, it's difficult because you need a lot of core strength, yeah? And I go to the gym a lot, do you know what I mean? So I know, yeah, for certain things you need core strength, right? For you to be doing this, yeah, with one leg, honestly, it's incredible. It deserves a round of applause because, honestly, for me, what a guy. Like, some of the things he was doing in that um, semi-final, insane and here honestly equally insane do you know what's interesting as well yeah or not even interesting it's fascinating like it, it, it leaves you speechless yeah the choreography, the creativity, actually, you know what, yeah, that's it, the creativity, like, I don't know if he's got someone helping him out with this kind of thing, right, but it's very creative, and obviously, like, he's had to adapt to um, his circumstances, and he's done that very, very well, better than most people would, to be honest with you. <laughs> You know what's like, look at where I stopped it, yeah? This is what's the best thing about it, right? He does it with a smile on his face. He could be feeling sorry for himself in his circumstance here, yeah? but you know what, yeah? He's decided, I'm gonna make the best of the situation. I've got this talent, and I'm gonna showcase it to the whole of Britain, the whole of the world, and I'm gonna do it with a smile on my face. He said he wanted to be an inspiration for everyone, and he definitely is that. <laughs> Now, you see what I'm saying there, yeah? So, getting down and coming back up like that, yeah, takes a lot of core strength. And to be doing that, yeah, with a crutch in one hand, yeah, and on one leg too, is insane. Honestly, for me, yeah, like, I, after seeing that semi-final performance, there's not enough words, yeah, I can, like, use to describe how I feel towards this guy. Because, honestly, it's one of the best things I've ever seen. Like, it's... it's it's mind boggling and you know what yeah I wish this guy all the best in the final because yeah man that big inspiration <laughs> just gives you goosebumps it just gives you goosebumps honestly like I don't even know what to say, like, you guys let me know in the comments below, yeah, what words would you use to describe him, because he's an inspiration, and you know what, every single positive or, or just good word you can find in the dictionary, right, you can put his face next to it, because for me, yeah, 
it just like it takes a lot it takes a lot yeah to be doing what you're doing especially in this world as well where people judge and people just like label you with stuff when like people are cruel do you know what i mean and for him to be doing this inspiration smile on his face and super super talented yeah i've never seen anything like this before <laughs> Do you know what, yeah, I've never seen the judges, right? So, like, universally, just kind of out of it, do you know what I mean? Like, normally, um, one or two of them might be looking at it, they're gobsmacked, emotional, whatever it might be. The others might make a joke here and there, like Ant and Deck, for example. But for this one, they've all got straight faces, tears in their eyes, and just look at the way Ant said that, sensational. Look at Amanda, hands on head, saying, Oh my god, like it's, it's incredible to watch. And I think to be honest with you, it's probably the one um, contestant this year that's left everyone speechless. That doesn't necessarily mean um, he's everyone's favorite, um, but he's the one that's universally left everyone speechless. Nah man, look at the footwork, look at the speed, and look at the, the precision in every single thing he's doing. Now, I'm not a dancer, do you know what I mean? Like, I, I can dance, yeah, but like, he's, I'm never reaching these levels of, of like dance moves, you know what I mean? That is sharp dancing, yeah? And it's left people like Bruno Tonioli speechless, do you know what I mean? Tears in his eye. And um, yeah man, like when you know his story, um, the things he's been through, where he is now, yeah, and to be doing this, um, yeah, you don't even have to be like a, like a professional dancer to, to be feeling this emotional and also to know how good he is. Let me know in the comments below because obviously we've seen him now in the semi-final and we're going to see him in the final on Sunday, right? Let me know in the comments below um, which audition uh, or performance did you like better, the first one or the second one? The problem is for me, um, I did it the opposite way. So I've seen the semi-final but I hadn't seen this audition. So if I had seen this audition, the element of surprise would have been like, oh my lord, I can't believe what I'm seeing, right? And then obviously the semi-final was incredible too. But because I saw him in the semi-final first, I was like, oh my lord, what am I seeing, right? Insane. And now I'm seeing it, so I'm not as surprised with this one. But um, yeah, you guys have seen it the correct way around. Let me know in the comments below which one you find the better performance. Sensational. Sensational. Okay, so that round of applause was probably the biggest one in this year's Britain's Got Talent. And look at the judges here. You had Simon who had a look of disbelief. You had Amanda who was in tears. You had Bruno who was very emotional. You had Ant and Deck giving him a pat on the back. You know what, yeah, fair play to him, man. Honestly, what a guy. And I'm looking forward to the final seeing him perform again. But now let's see the moment of the golden buzzer because this is what we're looking forward to. that's it for checking out this golden buzzer and um, let's talk about it quickly for me I'd probably say um, this one was the most emotional golden buzzer of this year's um, Britain's Got Talent I think um, just his story um, the way he showed us his talent as well I just think everything about him um, and everything about these um, performances were just next level and um, yeah I think the judges did the right thing here obviously they had pressed the golden buzzers a few times so they had no more left with it again it's the third time but they made a, an exception and um, yeah man they had to because um, he was just incredible so uh, yeah one of my favorite acts of this year's Britain's Got Talent and I can't wait to see what he's got for us in the final but that's it for the video guys gonna wrap things up thanks for watching make sure you like share subscribe comment below some more suggestions I'll try to check it out for you guys as always but I'm gonna have to love you and leave you so thanks for watching keep yourself safe out there have a good day have a good evening and until next time guys I hope you have a good one